We're here in New York City at 61st Street on the Flushing Line for an industry first. We're demonstrating our next generation positioning system fully integrated with the Flushing CBTC. Everybody, thank you for coming. Uh, just as a reminder, this train will be moving during the presentation. We want to be sure that you have something to hold on to near you in case there's a jerk. Watch where we are here on the line, and this one here will tell you what sensors are active as we go down the system. So we have five sensors installed on the train. Uh, three of them are for the UWB positioning system. The radar down here with an IMU that's installed inside the train gives us uh, the dometry. The UWB tags which are installed inside the bonnet gives us the positioning and also platform alignment. We also have a LiDAR and a camera installed on the train and those we use for alternate measurements and also uh, to give us the ground truth to prove the system. One of the main advantages of ultra wideband is that it gets us out of the roadbed when it comes to wayside equipment. All of the UWB equipment that we've installed here on the 7 line is actually on the wayside and that makes it easier for us to deploy, makes it faster, it saves on cost and most importantly, it's easier to maintain, which translates into fewer disruptions for riders, getting them where they need to go every day. The benefits of the new system are that it's more fault tolerant than the existing system. It's faster to install, so the projects are going to be lower cost and faster to deploy. What we're demonstrating today is how we are now fully integrated with communication-based train control. And that's the system that manages the flow of trains on the subways, letting them run closer together and delivering a better service for riders.